I'm Lee, and this week I want to make a bridge tool for my Hardy. Okay, I have a piece of leaf spring here, and I think that usable thickness, I think it kind of stops right in there maybe. It's like 11 inches. So I'm going to say three to right there, four, three more. What does that put me at? Ooh, that's pretty close. And then I will probably go four more for the hardy. Well, let's go four and a half. And then that will get folded up. So I need to make a tail section back here. So this cut off shoulder. This is a bend. This is a bend. And then I'm also going to cut through here with a cut off wheel while I'm doing it to give me a little bit of a horn on one side. So I just got to cut all this out with the grinder. I'm going to check this distance because it needs to be one inch. Wow, I'm pretty close. But it'll just get folded around to fit into the hardy hole. Alright, I have this cut. So I have my notch in here, which is probably around 3 8 I have the tail set up, which is roughly an inch. This will get folded around for the hardy hole. So I need two bends, one here and one here. So I'm going to double check these and I'm going to put a center mark in them just so I'm positive where it's at. I'm going to start by getting this thing nice and flat first. Alright, I want to fold this up underneath. This thing square. As ugly as that turned out, I think I was better off freehanding it over the anvil. See if I can do this again. Bend it right this time. Oh, come on. Agree with me.
It's off to a decent start. Get this little fella poked out of there. All right, I've got this thing finished. Now I've got the top sanded down with Tiger Paw. I hit this too. I don't really care about all the dents because I'm not really finishing on top of this. I'm just uh, mainly for tweaking. It's not really for that much weight. Fits in the hardy hole good. Sits down on the anvil just like I want. I've got my horn out here that I've polished up. Made sure it's nice and round for some of the smaller projects. Right here I put on this cutting edge and all that's for is for whenever I have something real tight and I need to sit against that something a little bit sharper. I have that on this side, this side's just straight. But this is good material, it's strong, it's cheap, and it's gonna work for this. Well, I hope you enjoyed this week's project. I appreciate you watching. I'll see you next week. I may have to bend this the other way. Didn't think about that. Redo.